<sighs> well, to all my fellow Blood Hunt solo brothers, they done did this shit to us again. Most of them niggas be capping half I'm scared of me, scared of me You fell in love with the bitch and she giving that head to me, head to me I used to fuck with them niggas, now all I'm dead to my dead to my Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Waves on Swim So they hate on him, is back in the building With another banger And I'm not gonna do this traditionally how I do every intro video Cause today is just a little more on the disappointing side And I thought I... I, I, I gave him a few days to try to fix this um, and it's the 12th and this update was made on the 7th and it still hasn't got fixed so I figure that's not we might as well address it on the channel because maybe we all see what's going on right now you guys don't know what I'm talking about as far as what the title says about this video let me read this tweet to you that came out from blood hunt on the 7th of February it says greetings Kendrick we have Updated our matchmaker for the solo slash duo game modes to balance skill levels and prioritize regional servers. Here are the changes: players of vastly different skill levels with no longer will no longer end up in the same matches. If the majority of players queue from one region, the game will always start on servers with that region. The goal of these changes is to get more fair matches where the majority of the players will experience a higher quality networking experience with lower latency. Now, if you don't understand, <clears throat> some of you may be looking at that tweet and some of you may be listening to the tweet and you're like, pollution, it doesn't sound that bad. Mm, it sounds as bad as you think. So let me break it down to you. But before I break it down, let me show you one of the tweets that came down from one of the players in the community that gives feedback. From Astavo. It's unfortunate you guys go one step forward then out of nowhere a thousand steps back. Now I'm going to be put in lobbies with basically no real players, 30 plus bots, question mark. The only reason why I came back to Blood Hunt was because Solos was officially back. Said I gotta stop playing again. Full of likes, two retweets. Then we get another tweet of feedback in which there were very many. These are just two that I decided to pick out. I played five solo matches today and had zero human players in my lobbies. You really killed the game with these changes. Having five to 10 players pro lobby was perfect for me. Having zero opponents is a useless gaming experience. I will not play again. With that being said, right? Reading this, I'm going to break down this tweet from Blood Hunt and let you know what this does for solos. If you're a solo player. And also, apparently, it's for solos and duos. So that means the only thing we'll get remotely to as in getting all real players is trios. But as far as the solos and duos community, I am a solo player. Yes, I do play solos and I do play duos and I play trios as well. But I think I play my solo. I think I play solos majority of the time. The skill based matchmaking system, right? It is a good thought, but not at this phase into the game. As you, it, whether if you're new or not, or whether you've been here since Blood Hunt first came out, Blood Hunt was experiencing problems where we had a big player drop off. And as you, as you guys know, we are coming into our better days. The game is starting to get a little more, you know what I mean? We're starting to pick up traction again. But like I said, again, we had a very down spiral to where there were not many players on at all. You were running to the same people over and over and over and over again. I'm just now starting to see new names now. What the skill-based matchmaking will do for if not some to at least 40% of the fan bases, those matches where you were getting, what, let's say give or take 12, 13, 15, 20 players, and maybe you get another 20 bots or something like that. We're now going to start to see five players, the 10 players in every single solos match. That shit is not cool at all, bro. No one signed up to play against bots only. I mean, I understand that they want to separate the skill gap between players that has been here for a long time and players that are coming in new but i feel with with that what you do with that is right if you want to implement something like that and this is just an idea you take the people with the um you take the people that's coming in fresh you make them go into the new players you make them do the new trial whatever the fuck you call it 
and then you put the ass into team deathmatch for a certain amount of time that way they get them used to the gameplay and the game style team deathmatch is always bumping i think i found a team deathmatch match in no time why keep deteriorating or why keep throwing a punch or a blow at solos and duos when you know that's some that's some things that players only play like and then if you come in here right and you come in solos and your first experience is me playing solos but i'm playing a bunch of fucking bots for people that like to come in here and play real players what do you think that's going to make them be like i'm gonna get off this bot shit fucking bot city bro now this is not one thing where i just came up here and i said I'm gonna just make a rant video about or I'm gonna just make a video about no I play matches and I'm looking at my matches and yet again we come out with an update where I'm playing 30% of I'm not even 30 I'm playing like 30 blocks with like and me being generous I'm giving 10 real humans this shit is not fun at all I'm a level 120 I'm not even that high I don't even get to play I don't even get to play the game that much but when I do I like to play but I don't like to play against fucking bots 24-7 Blood Hunt, I feel like the last few updates were good. Don't get me wrong. The last few updates were good. I think there were some very good changes for the game going forward. But this was an AO update. When or where did anyone say they wanted skill-based matchmaking back or that we should go this route when it comes to this or when it comes to our matchmaking? It's hell of an AO update. I think what's next for Blood Hunt or what we need to focus on, really? I think we should implement another game mode. It's all about what's next. It's all about getting new players and also the players you lost back. I think we should implement a new game mode. I think Aim Assist got buffed, I mean nerfed a little bit, if I'm not mistaken, because I don't think Aim Assist has been hitting like that as it was like over the last few weeks, but I could be wrong. If it's not nerf, nerf aim assist again. Tweak it down a little bit, bring it down. I would like to see more cosmetics. It feels like um, Blood Hunt really gave up on the cosmetic scene. Like they're not dropping as many like new costumes and things like that in the store. Now they're only, it seems like we're only doing Twitch drops. And the Twitch drops be cool and all, but what the fuck? What am I gonna do with one, two Twitch drops per, what, three, four fucking weeks? Why are we not doing it like, for example, Call of Duty, where every time I go to the goddamn store, there's a new there's a new system. Yes, I know Call of Duty is a bigger studio, but it still gives no excuse for like the same outfits to be in the store for the past two, three months. Like, come on, y'all. It, it's but so much benefit of the doubt we can give. Um, I'm sure there are way more ways that we can get the game. Um on the upper hand or on a better foot or you know what i mean going forward we can make more w changes but like i said i just think this one was an l and i think for the solos community and the duos community i don't think we're happy you know what i mean i don't think that's i didn't think that was a cool update that's just my thoughts on it but hear me out let me know what you thought about the update in the comment section let me know if you didn't even feel a difference let me know if you didn't even feel like this happened you know what i mean um or you maybe think I'm completely wrong and you know what I mean? You like the update. Let me know down in the comments section. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. Also, turn your post notifications on, bro. We got three videos coming out every single week. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Look for them. I typically always drop at 12 o'clock. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys have a nice day. Peace.